editions, the SA Canon and Fokker Eindecker, which is this kit. This is a limited edition from the uh, Eduard Eindecker kit, which is normally uh, coming in the weekend edition. I will stress on the, the differences between the weekend edition, so the standard kit, and this one. So I will stress on the extras which is inside this box here. Uh, this got the reference 1141. If you want a detailed uh, review on the kit itself, the airplane itself, go and check out Alex Modeling, which did recently a very nice review of the kit. The sprues are the same as in the Edward kit. Here in this uh, box are only extras edited. As you can see, it's a very nice art box. A little bit in soft colors, a little bit like the type it was. Uh, the postcards were in World War I uh, period. Uh, this is 148 scale, dual combo, that means there are two identical kits inside this box. As you can see, here on the sides another art box, and here are the extras included inside this box. That means we got two complete Fokker Eindecker kits included, with express marks and PE accessories. There are two resin figures in 1915 style, portrait cards of Max Immelmann and Ostwald Bölke. And then there is a small extra, an 8mm Iron Cross emblem is added as a dress pin, so you can put it on your cap or on your shirt, whenever you want. And then five marking options of Feynman German Eindecker experts so, let's go on. As you can see, it is quite a small box, but there are actually two 148 kits inside this box. Let's look at the box. So, we got here the box, and it's fully packed until top level. Sturdy, nice box from Edward, as usual. As you can see inside, we got two bags with exactly identical airplanes inside. So let's look just briefly inside one of the, uh, the bags. So if, for, if you re really are interested in it and you want a completely review of it, go and check Alex Modeling, who did the uh, review on the weekend edition of this airplane, which is the same. The sprues are the same, I mean to say. So, we got here small canopy parts. It's very tiny, but you will see the masks for this very tiny piece are included. We got one sprue with the wings and the fuselage. Other one with the fuselage, the props, and there are two props included. So you can train on one for doing the wood scheme. You can train on one and have one uh, for uh, final mounting on the airplane. And uh, you get also the engine over there and the fuselage. Which is quite a small, it's a 48 scale, 148 scale, but this is really, it's a small airplane. And then the last, uh, the last sprue here. Let's see, you will have a better contrast on this. With all tiny details of the interior frame and so. So that will be nice designs, nice work to do with uh, replicating the wood on those all those small structures here, which is the inside of the cockpit structure. 
let me go back to the previous brew so that you can see a little bit better the details on the grey background here. And the other sides, so you can see mostly most of the first and second sprue uh, duplicate. So you get double, double engine and double props here. So that is for the sprues. Let's go to the extras of this um, of this kit. So first of all first extra edit is those cards here from the pilots who were using the, the, the famous pilots who were using them. It was Max Immelmann. Like a card will be a nice frame, framed, nice nicely painted and so with uh, with the the, the Fokker one replicated over here. At the back of those cards you get a brief History of his uh, World War One carrier. Then you get the same from Oswald Bölke, same card with again the small CV biography in the back. And then extra to this. Is coming two resin figures actually of those two men, the Bulker and Immelmann. Here you got Immelmann in a relaxed pose with cross legs standing there. Very nicely detailed. Would be a nice addition if you do a uh, diorama. And here is the Oswald Bölke figure. The same, relaxed. Just some cleaning up to do here. But that should be not a big problem. Other extras to this um, limited edition. You get a photo edge. You get, I hope you can see it well. You get a large sprue here, or oh, fret, with mainly all the uh, engine parts detailed, highly detailed, which is not included in the weekend edition. And here you get a small fret with the interior parts, belts, and so, and the uh, and uh, instruments. And they are pre-painted. I know some guys don't like it. I don't care. With some weathering, a little bit weathering, it looks quite nice. Then you got the mask, yeah, from Edward for the tiny, tiny, tiny canopy there, which is actually more a shield, a windshield, let's call it. You got here. As they say, the Iron Cross pin, which you can add to your cup, to your shirt, whatever. It's nice quality also. It's like a enamel uh, hard coated uh, metal Iron Cross. It's nice. And then we got here the uh, decals, which I checked before. which are from Edward and um, they are a little bit more on the glossy type and they are let's say medium thick they are not that thin but I think bah, with a little bit of softener it might go well this first sheet and this is I think the one which is uh, included in the weekend edition and then you get for this edition here you got a bigger sheet here with numbers and small stencils uh, and it's the same quality as the other one so it's a little bit glossy and a little bit thick.
So you will have a lot of extras for your spare box. Then let's go to the decal sheet. Decal sheet is in a nice glossy paper, like a small booklet, stampled for those who care. You get a small introduction of uh, the airplane. You get here a first uh, version of the decals and the painting scheme. Anyway, you will see there will be only one painting scheme for whatever version you do. We got here the sprue map. Not much part of the dark parts are the part which is a duplicate, which I only used once. It's not much. And we go on with the the actual building cockpit and so. As I told you, if you want a complete review on it, go on Alex Modeling. The, the, the kit is the same. If you accept the, the, the photo etch uh, parts, for the rest it's exactly the same kit. And then, which I like, here in the middle, it's unusually, but it's completely in the middle of the book. We got one, two, three, four pages of colored, of colored uh, schemes, with the, also the decades. These are positioned in the middle so that you can take them out of the booklet easily and use it for your painting uh, later on. It's a nice touch. It's very thick paper, very detailed, nice, nicely uh, clear instructions, a few steps only per, per building step. You get seven pages like that. For mounting, and then at the end, we get the two figures with the paint call outs. For those who are interested, the paints are coming, call outs are coming, I think it is, uh, let me see. Uh, the paints are coming in, yeah, in Gunze. So that is uh, Mr. Color and the Aquarius, which are the uh, the water-based colors uh, of Gunze, and you get uh, Mr. Metal color, which is also all Gunze colors. But anyway, for those you can find the equivalent colors uh, in whatever range uh, you like to use. So that's it. I hope uh, you liked uh, this small review. Uh, it's a very nice kit. It's uh, at full price. It is uh, turning around. It's in the beginning of the, the end 30s, 40s euros like that. I had it uh, at a discount price, uh, and it had the price was finally 28 euros for the kit for two airplanes. So uh, we are reaching finally the price of uh, one combo of the sorry one uh, weekend edition of this kit from Edward, which is about twelve euros, fourteen euros. And then uh, you get but you get all the extras added, and you got two planes. So either you can do two different versions of it, or you train on one and you make one masterpiece of the other kit. Up to you. Thanks for watching. Have a nice uh, holiday season here in Europe. It's just getting very warm, very bright, as you can see the sunshine all over the desk. Have fun.